They often say there's nothing quite like representing your country. Hi, everybody. James Cebulski, Ray Ferrall, ready for this international showdown tonight. Puck is dropped to that hockey. The Hurricanes play it along the wing. Team Canada's got the puck along the boards. Look at this. It's a two-on-one. And not much on that one. Puck picked up by Burns. Musa quickly over to Crosby. Stays with it. And now he moves it quickly to Slavin. Feeds it over to Burns. Steps into the offensive end. Team Canada's got control of it now from their own end. On the attack along the boards. And that's deflected off someone in front. Slides it across to McKinnon. Skates to the crease. Oh, what a stop by Fleury. Sharp reaction save. That's on the stick. Here's a chance behind the net. They are really fussing here in the offensive end. And that's taken from the corner. And it's picked up by the defense. Gains the zone. Here's the pass. Oh, it's in. He scores! Canada's got the game's first goal as they lead here. one nothing early in the first. Always awesome to be in front of the game. You push the pace. You make the other team uncomfortable when you're up front. Goes right to the crease. Decides to think about it. Quick pass to Marner. Canada's got it against the boards. Here's a chance. Sends it in front. Takes the blast. And he makes the save. Feeds it down low. There's another stop. They're going to keep things moving here. Hooked away at center by Theodore. Flailing at it with a stick to try to get control. Receives the pass. Handles the pass. Denies it in front. Stahl's got it across the line. And he takes a shot. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Moves it to no wow. side. Scores! And they've even the score on that one. Even though they've been behind, James, I think they've played a pretty good game here. They haven't let the game escape from them. They haven't chased it. Now they've got the equalizer, and they've got the momentum. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Past the halfway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Stalls won it. Carolina's gained the line and into the zone. We got a whistle penalty coming up. And we got a fight. It doesn't even have to be a hard shot. It can be a muffin, but everybody is going to defend the goalie when you shoot the puck that late after a whistle. Well, that'll do it as they ride them off to the penalty box, each to their own bench to sit for five minutes. I hope he can get a drink of water. Last time in there, the bottle was empty, which really must stink, because you're tired and thirsty, and now you get a bowl of duck. You don't miss a thing, do you? No, I, I, I never was in there. Well, yeah, I was in there, and I hated when the bottle was empty. Theodore's going to play into the corner. Make the connection on the play. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Crosby's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. Pockets drop, play resumes. And now it's grabbed by Burns. Canada's got the puck along the wall. Poked away in the neutral zone by Slavin. Maintains possession. Crosby's crossed the line and is on the attack now. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Can't find his man. The Hurricanes get the job done shorthanded. We are still tied here. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. 
inside the final minute of the first here. Poked away at center by Burns. Cut grab by Couturier. And he comes up with it. Anderson's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Bergeron's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. And with that, the first period comes to an end. Both teams will have a chance to get a breather, and they'll be back on the ice with period number two in not too long. Still tied up here as we get underway here in period number two. Ray, as we get things underway here in this... Break the deadlock here, James. Now you get out in front, you can dictate the pace of the game. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Puck scooped up by McKinnon. McDavid's got it on the offensive end. Hangs on to the puck. Carolina's looking to break out of their own end. Into the offensive zone. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty coming up. sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Down one, a chance to tie on the power play. What a great chance for them here. But you can't stress, you have to be confident and aggressive, but don't force anything. And now it's over to Marchand. Takes the pass. Looking to make something happen along the boards. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Sends the pass in front. What a chance, but they can't connect. Denied by the goaltender. Here's a short pass to Theodore. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kotkaniemi. Misses! Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Carolina's crossed the line and on the attack. Riley's up at the box. That's blocked by Fleury. Obviously not a more dangerous place on the ice to shoot the puck from dead center. Shooter tries to go under the bar, and the goalie is better with the glove. Jarvis setting up against the wall. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Moves the puck up to Marner. And they'll go on the attack. Great pressure by Pacioretty. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kotkaniemi. Team Canada's got a hold of it against the wall. Canada's got it in their own zone. Sends a pass over. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Don't mind the idea, but it doesn't work. Now you got to chase. And that's broken up. Picked up along the boards by Riley. Stamkos plays it all alone. Oh, nice hands, great finish. Little short break, and it's in the net. Team Canada's now made their way back to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, Ray? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Don't back up. Passes it in front, and that's intercepted. Right up the gun into the offensive end. Oh, it comes up with a big stop there. Taken by Shea. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Pesci. Canada's got it in their own zone. Nosen's got it to the side. Here's a chance! Denied by Fleury. Nason's looking a little rejuvenated. He had that fight earlier. Now he had a five-minute break to rest. And he's back at it. A good shot on goal. And a solid save there as we play on. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. And sends it just out of reach. Pass broken up. Team Canada's got a hold of it along the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Team 
Canada showing no signs of letting up tonight. I don't think they want it. Why stop? Keep playing the game to score. Keep trying to push your opponent backwards. They've had a great night. Picked up along the wall by Couturier. Less than a minute to go here in the second. Canada's gained possession along the boards. Team Canada's looking to break out. Break away! And can't convert! James, he's so close to making a change in this game, but he doesn't get the shot off. There's the horn, 40 minutes in the books. We'll get a refresh for both the players. Ice, back with a third period next. And they've dropped the puck on period number three. I'd be curious if they take their foot off the gas because it has been a blowout to this point. Ray Ferraro is at ice level and he gives us his assessment of what he's seen tonight. Canada's focus now is just lock down this game. Comfortable lead. They've been terrific through 40 minutes. Don't give it away now. Team Canada's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, the power play gets another opportunity. They haven't been super busy tonight, but here's a chance to get on the board. Canada's got it now. Stamkos plays it against the boards. Flurry's now at the bench, and the extra attacker's on the ice. McDavid's able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. Scores! Well, they tried to pull the goalie, and it backfired. Ah, probably seemed like a good idea at the time, but you got no goalie. You better get the puck and hold on to it. They don't, and it ends up in their cage again. Carolina's narrowed the gap here in the third, but still a long way to go, Red. Uh, James, this is still way down the road to even this game up. But if you get one, maybe you get another. Maybe they get nervous. And that caroms off a body in traffic. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And he shut the door on that last play. Aho's ready to go. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Stone. Team Canada's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. They're not going to be too thrilled when they get a look at the film on that power play. Ineffective and, maybe more importantly, they give up the shorthanded goal. Carolina's got possession here in the offensive zone. Can't get it to go. Puck picked up by Stamkos. Sends it over to McDavid. Nice zone entry on the left side. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. Keeps hold of the puck. Cutting to the front of the net. Big time stop. But he came out and challenged a good save. Team Canada's got the puck in the defensive end. And now it's grabbed by Stankos. Quick feed to McDavid. Team Canada's playing it through the neutral zone. Here he is with the backhander. You gotta finish him off. The chances are there, but you still gotta put him away. It's a great play, and now we can celebrate his three-goal night. Now, would you ever wear one of those chapeaus? Not on a night? chance. <laughs> would you wear someone else's hat? Absolutely not. Carolina's got it in the neutral zone. Team Canada's got a hold of the puck now. Moves around along the half wall. He's been really good on these high danger chances, and here's another one right from the slot. But he's trying to Well, the momentum is clearly switched now, James. Back to back goals for them. Canada's lamp lighting performance continues here with another goal in the third. They can walk home. They have dominated this third period. They've stretched the lead out into a really comfortable margin. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. Manages to hang on. Driving right to the front. And a quick save on that one. Flurry's had a really easy night here, James. I don't know how it could be much easier than this. Nice zone entry from the middle. Moves it quickly over to Huberto. Keeps it alive and heads it up. Things starting to get a little physical out there. And that pass is redirected. Makar's moving the puck through his own zone. 
Makes a move in front, and they score! It's the signs of life here on one end of the, end of the bench. Well, you got to dig in for anything positive you can. I mean, if I'm the goal scorer, I'm pretty pumped that I got on the board. But you look up at the big board, and you realize you got a long way to go. The team's got to dig in a little bit here. Can you get another quick one? Can you get yourself in some way, shape, or form back in this game? Carolina's back at center ice. They have a long way to go still here, though, Ray. Yeah, get your scorers out there, James. Don't worry about the defensive end of the ice. You need goals. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. The Hurricanes looking against the half wall. Canada's got the puck. Tries to get it to McKinnon. Carolina's got the puck. Here's a chance, and that caroms off a body in the lane. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. Comes up with the stop. And he'll opt to play the puck here. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Puck grabbed by Shea. Team Canada's got possession of the puck. There's a big hit against the boards. You want to squeeze by because you know the middle of the ice is the bad place. You go up the wall sometimes. The door gets slammed. Rocks him. Can't make the connection on the pass. Denies him. Team Canada's trying to lose the defender. Oh, what a stop on the one-on-one. -on -one. What a great play to get in on the goaltender all by himself. But turned away with an excellent save. Yeah.